hi you're welcome to our channel once again as always today is an opportunity for you to learn something new in this video i'm going to walk you through how to change whatsapp autocorrect and web suggestion settings let's get into whatsapp and i'll show you exactly what i mean so to access those settings you need to click and hold the comma so now that i have clicked and i'm holding on to the comma you see the certain icon has popped up then we can make a choice from here but with some with some phones once you open the keypad at the top side here the top part of the keyboard you see the certain icon here so you can easily click it from there if you open yours and it is not there that is when you use the comma you click and hold the comma then you choose android keyboard settings now choose test correction so with test correction we have these other sub menus and a test correction that we can use we are going to see how each of these will affect the outcome or the outputs of your conversation in whatsapp so for the first part personal dictionary with a personal dictionary it's just words that you have defined for yourself so for instance ahonia is my name and it's not available in the english dictionary hence on the regular when you are typing it out in whatsapp whatsapp will see it as an error or as a spelling mistake and underline it will give it a red underline but now you see that it is not underlined because it is identifying it within the dictionary that has been defined for it so that is what to do when you want your phone to identify a word as correct just add it to your personalized dictionary so these are words that i have added you can add more by just clicking the plus icon here then you add anywhere that you want okay let's go back to the next one i want to talk about is block offensive words so once this one is enabled during your typing words that are offensive will not be suggested let's see exactly what i'm talking about uh, if you anytime you are typing something words that are similar to what you are typing is being suggested so let's say f now that i've typed f so they are suggesting similar ways for me f u c there is an offensive word that is close to this spelling that i'm spelling that is f u c k i know you know that so you realize that throughout the spelling from f u c there was no mention of it among the suggestions but if we were to turn this particular one off let's disable the block offensive words then try it again start typing f u c you realize that it is being suggested in the middle f u c k as the word because now you've turned off the block offensive words so if you don't want suggestions of words that are offensive then you have to make sure that this is enabled the next item we want to talk about is the auto correct option so with auto correct space bar and punctuation automatically correct mistyped words so if you end up typing a wrong a word wrongly once you click the space bar or a full stop then automatically it will be corrected so let's say i spell sweet as s w e t e so you see that down here the right word is there now once i click the space bar it's giving me the right word let's go turn it off and let me show you exactly what will happen when it is disabled we've disabled the autocorrect so once we type our s w e t e even though we see the right word down here as a suggestion by a click of the space bar we do not get the setting and this word is not identified in any of the dictionaries so it is underlined as being wrong okay let's go back the next one is show correction suggestions 
so as we keep typing you realize that words were being suggested for us and it is only because that particular word suggestion has been turned on so as we start spelling the same words being suggested even though we couldn't get the spelling of sweet correct you can see the right spelling has been suggested down here let's go and turn that one off and see the outcome so once you turn off show correction settings then back see it let's type uh you see there are no suggestions here so now you can't get to see any related word that may be right or wrong so that is what happens let's go back in any case when you want autocorrect turn off then you just have to turn off the autocorrect but when you want the suggested words also to be turned off that is when you click the show correction suggestions you turn that one off but i want it to be on so let me enable that one the further ones with personalized suggestions so depending on the conversation that you've been typing out regularly the phone will automatically be giving you suggestions in relation to data that you've been typing if you enable the personalized suggestions if you enable the suggest contacts names you know some contacts the the names of individuals are not english words and hence you may detect them as being wrong or will not suggest them in the first place but once this is on it will still add the contact list on your phone to the dictionary that it picks information from so that it can suggest words from your contact or names from your contact once you start typing them the last part is the next word suggestion so this is use the previous word in making suggestions so based on what you have already typed the phone can then make a prediction on what you are likely going to write these are the various settings when it comes to test correction in whatsapp so you can change you can in either enable or disable any of them depending on your preference i hope you have learned something new today don't forget to give this video a thumbs up and also subscribe to our channel to show us some love share the video with your colleagues so that you also learn something new today and leave your comments in the comment section below thanks for watching and see you in the next video bye